Yeah, so 13 News Now exclusive. We're hearing from Portsmouth's new city manager. She's talking with us as she takes the lead in a city that's made headlines for some of the wrong reasons recently. Portsmouth City Council hired Angel Jones last month. So what's her vision for the city? Allie Weatherton spoke with Jones about what the future holds. She's the newest city leader in Portsmouth. People have come up to me, you know, just in the last week saying how grateful they are that I'm here. Angel Jones is ready to hit the ground running as Portsmouth city manager. She started the job last week. I see opportunities to maximize our resources. I see opportunities to strengthen the businesses that are here and encourage new businesses to come. Jones says she has big plans, but wants to focus first on the city's financial stability and economic development. While one may see a challenge, I see an opportunity. That first opportunity is to tackle the short staffing within the Portsmouth Police Department. My first step would be to put in leadership that understands the uniqueness of this community. She plans to meet with members of the police department to see what works and what needs improving. We would ensure that our salaries are comparable, our working conditions are favorable, and that we institute training not only for new hires but existing hires to ensure that everyone is stays current to what the issues are and that they're prepared to do their jobs. Jones says the city of Portsmouth is moving in a positive direction and she said people should be proud of the progress. The thing for me to do is focus on those positives and share the successes as we continue to work on the things that need to be improved but not let those be our story. Let our story be the things that we are achieving. In Portsmouth, Allie Weatherton, 13 News Now. Jones beat out more than 70 applicants for the position. She left her job as a senior consultant at a management firm. Jones previously worked as a city manager in Gaithersburg, Maryland and in Eugene, Oregon.